Hi, I'm Dr. Max here in Max Medical Robotic Hair Restoration Clinic. Let's talk about methods of implantation. Implantation was always a most challenging part of uh, hair restoration procedure. The reason is traditionally, either with FUT or FUE procedures, the surgeon will make incision and the actual process of implantation will be solely depend on hair transplant technician. Here's come a dilemma. Implantation could be very traumatic for grafts. In order to insert the graft into the small incision, which is typically less than one millimeter in length, it requires to grasp the graft with the forcep, then align the graft with a little tiny incision, and then fit it into the incision by grasping the graft several times. As the FUE procedures become more precise and the grafts smaller and thinner, that could be a problem because there's not much tissue you can safely grasp on those potential injury to the graft become a real concern. So here comes the method of direct graft implantation. Direct graft implantation does not require forcep in order to insert the graft into the incision. Furthermore, there is no incision required because the graft is inserted by the needle which actually inject the graft into the skin without any traumatic action for those little FUE grafts. It could be done robotically, such as IX robotic system that was introduced relatively recently. It allows us to load grafts into cartridges one by one. Each cartridge can hold 25 grafts and then we simply change the cartridges as the robot implants grafts one by one into the desired area. It could be done with sharp implanters. The way I like to do it is to utilize as much as possible direct graft implantation. Direct graft implantation requires a lot of staff coordination. I as a surgeon will implant every single graft using sharp implanter assisted by several staff members that help with loading implanters. I developed several devices to achieve a graft implantation more comfortable for the patient, comfortable staff, as well helping to increase of speed of graft implantation. Direct graft implantation allows me to evaluate existing hair and mimic the same pattern with the hair direction, hair density. I can find certain areas with higher degree of the hair loss and blend into these areas. A direct graft implantation and sort of like a 3D printing in real time. I can see the areas that missing more hair, add more grafts. I can see where the spaces in between existing hair exist and I can rescan it again. If I see something is missing somewhere, I can add a graft. With the site making more traditional way, it's almost impossible because once the site making is done and most of the procedure will be completed by hair transplant technicians. That's the reason I like direct graft implantation because it allows me to participate more and take responsibility for the entire procedure versus just part of it.